Hello everybody. Um, come and go with me to the kitchen. I made a cheeseburger soup. Hold on y'all. Let me get out the room. Alright everybody. I hope you can hear me. Y'all, I made a cheeseburger soup. <coughs> I um, wanted something delicious. Um, it's been very cold here where I live, and I wanted something really, really good. And what I did, I made a cheeseburger soup. So before I show it to you, let me just tell you real quick. Imagine if you got a big old cheeseburger with your ground beef, your tomato, your cheese, your onion, or whatever. It's the same thing, just in a pot, but no bread. So what I did, I wanted something comforting because I have been under the weather. I have not been feeling well. And I had took out some ground beef, and I wanted to make an actual burger. But then when I got in the kitchen, I said, you know what? I don't even want to bite into a whole lot of bread. And y'all, I'm telling you, by the grace of God, I just made a cheeseburger soup. So I just kind of came up with it on my own, basically, like I always do. And what I did was I put some, let me see if I can get the camera. I think I'm about to keep the camera back here. Okay, I'll try to spoon it up what i did was basically I, I just took um ground beef and browned it up really really good and then after that i put a whole bunch of seasoning like i was seasoning a hamburger patty i'm gonna try to bring this over i just feel like you can't see it there we go that's that's a little better so what i did was i took the um ground beef browned it up really good and instead of making like a hamburger patty, I put all the seasonings for like for a patty. But then I broke up my meat like this. And then after my ground beef browned up really, really well, then I added some more seasoning. And I let that cook for about 20 to 30 minutes so that I knew that my ground beef was completely cooked. Then I took um, some elbow macaroni. You see those? I buy the large elbow macaroni, and they poof up like huge. So, 88 cents at Walmart, but I get those extra large pasta. I'm trying to let y'all see that pasta. That's about five pieces of pasta in this big old spoon, and that's why I buy the extra large elbow pasta. So, I put that in there, and then I added. Let me show you what I added. Hold on. I added a can of Walmart diced tomatoes and green chili. So that's just your Rotel tomatoes. So I put one can of that only in there. Okay. And then I put a can of queso cheese in there. Let me see if I can get that jar. Hold on. Okay, so I put a jar of salsa con queso. This is what I normally make my Rotel nacho stuff out of. So I wanted that cheeseburger taste. So I put a jar of that. Okay. And then last but not least, I put some shredded cheese. You can put your uh, taste of shredded cheese. I like sharp cheddar or Mexican cheese or Monterey Jack and Colby. It don't matter. But I just use some shredded cheese. So after I put all that in, I just let that simmer for about another 30 minutes. And basically, I just came up with what I'm calling a cheeseburger soup because it that macaroni cooked up good. That ground beef is in there just like a burger. You see that? You see how the liquid is dripping, even though that's chili con queso and shredded cheese. So when this sits for about another probably 30 minutes, because I take foil, and after I make a soup, I put the foil with the shiny side down, and then I put the top on that. And so whatever's in your soup pan... It just steams, it steeps it. So when you open up that pot, like what you're seeing right now, it looks like a very soupy 
well, cheeseburger soup. Okay. But when I open this pot up in about another 30 minutes with that foil on top, it's going to come together and it's going to be so thick, y'all. But I'm going to give y'all one more look. A delicious cheeseburger soup. Perfect for the snow. Mm -mm -mm. You can dip it, that cheese, them seasoning, that ground beef, them rotel tomatoes. Just imagine a, a, a cheeseburger that's just in a soup form. And I, I'm going to tell you the truth now. I'm just ready for this one. Look at that. Look at that. You can eat that all night, warm. Hey, warm and delicious. Nice and cold. Imagine that, y'all. All right, I had to linger a little bit. I got kind of caught up in my own video, but there it is, a cheeseburger soup, y'all. It's so easy. You can substitute the ground beef for chicken, but hey, it's a cheeseburger soup, or you can make you a chicken cheese soup. It don't matter. Hey, it's delicious, y'all. Be blessed. I love you.